See this big ass car lot behind me here? I'm out doing some late night creeping. Uh, look, this is where the gang stalkers get their uh, cars from. Uh, basically, the police, whoever doesn't pay their freaking uh, impound bill, they can deputize a car like this and just roll it like it's stolen, like because it literally is stolen. Uh, and they can also issue these cars out to their college student, you know, uh, snitches in training, citizens on patrol, uh, citizens on patrol, uh, ho uh, anyway, another thing in there, dude, there's these plastic liners in there, right across the street, there's a place called Spartan Plumbing, and it's a place that makes acid, if you watch breaking bad there's a part a portion where uh they get this plastic container and they fucking melt a dude in acid uh and uh my ex was made this kind of connection that there's all these little places none of them by themselves are really look harmful but when you add it up plus they got the inside turn barbed wire uh and once again, anytime I see Spartan, man, it uh, makes me think of military industrial complex, but citizens on patrol ask type facilities. Anyway, my, you know, myself. But yeah, they got basically plastic bed liners in here. Like uh, there was a company that was going to make a bunch of new truck bed liners. But it's like, it's like for what, man? It's like, look, dude, we know the economy is going up. Uh, belly under so why are you making all this stuff what if they're not really for trucks man they're actually fema coffins maybe those fema coffins aren't really coffins maybe they are non not acid proof containers this right here here's another little enclosed fence area uh what if those bed liners are actually fucking uh, what is that called? Dissolve chambers for bodies that they gonna use during martial law when they go door to door and start shooting people who are not loyalists. Anyway, save some save some footage for later on down the journey. Peace.